Hello, my name is Dr. Gleb Kartsev. I'm a physical therapist at Back to Health Physical Therapy. We today at the location of 2148 Ocean Parkway, and today I would like to share my knowledge and recommendations what I usually repeat to my patients about the proper posture. Lately I see a lot of people who are suffering from the neck pain, upper back, even lower back pain that are demonstrating very poor posture. Primarily those people like having sitting jobs, like accountants, uh, tailors, everybody have to sit for a long time, especially when it's taking over the hour. They complaining of increasing back pain, headaches, stiffness, soreness. So I constantly have to reiterate the importance of the proper sitting posture. Everybody knows that standing, you have to walk straight, keep your shoulders back. This is not known, but little people know about the sitting posture, even though the information is widely available across the board, like on the internet, literature, everywhere. So short education about the proper sitting posture. Here we're using our standard desk that we have at the office and chairs. So I'm going to demonstrate first the setup of how you should try to keep your posture throughout the day. We all humans, everything is happening, like a lot of stuff happening around us and it might change, you might fatigue, therefore make sure you put yourself reminders on the phone and you can stand up, even standing up and walking around the chair for a few seconds like this as I just did will help to your joint to move, switch the position, muscle to palpate more blood through them. Even this small trick doing executed about every hour will help you feel better at the end of your work day. So, keys to pay attention when you're trying to set your proper sitting position or working place. Make sure your feet are planted. They should be flat on the floor or if you have a foot rest and could be inclined a little bit, they should be planted. Try not to cross your legs because it will set off your hips and then affect your farther posture up the chain. Usually you may execute the lumbar support back, depends on the type of the chair you use at the office or whatever is available. So next thing, after you set up your legs, hips and lower back, we're gonna move in for the keyboard. You're looking for your elbows to be bent about 90 degrees or 100 degrees. If it's too low, it's gonna dra drag you to bend forward. If it's too high, you will have to, for example, if I'm gonna place it here, yes, it seemed to be fine, but in about 15, 20 minutes, when I'm like concentrating and I'm typing something, for example, my notes, I'm gonna be shrugging my shoulders and it's gonna start bothering me. Also, so this is where you wanna be, your shoulder blades. Bring your chest, same as with standing posture, bring your chest forward, try to touch your shoulder blades back, but without lifting your shoulders. So this sitting posture is already good. My feet are planted, knees about 90 degrees flexion, hips 90 and elbows 90 to 100. I'm sitting straight. Monitor. Even if this all good by my, by my monitor is too high or too low, I'm gonna be constantly sitting this way or this way. As soon as my chin drops a little bit, my whole body gonna go here. Doesn't matter how I'm well controlling myself. As soon as your concentration will shift, body will follow the head. That's why it's very important where your screen is being placed. Usually you want to have it on the eye of the level. Here and there about an inch or two variance up or down. But you want to see your eye level on the upper top of the screen. This is basic posture and it should look like this. This is sitting posture that you're trying to achieve. And in this case, you still will have to make sure that you're shifting your body, that you're moving from time to time. There's no prolonged positioning is good for you for too long. So we are located at Ocean Avenue 2148, Suite 301. That's one of our facilities. We also have three other facilities that addresses you can find in the comments below.